Hello and welcome to this tutorial on using your computer's backup program called Time Machine. Time Machine will allow you to back up important files on your computer should something unforeseen happen, like a hard drive crash. This is insurance against hard drive failure. In order to back up your files, you will need a place to store those files. When the laptops were distributed as students, each of you received a Lexar USB thumb drive. We will demonstrate how to use Time Machine to back up your documents to this Lexar thumb drive. Before we get started with the Time Machine backup demonstration, a few words about the Lexar USB thumb drive. Your thumb drive is small and somewhat fragile. You will want to take good care of the thumb drive and keep it in a safe, known location so as not to lose it. Your Lexar thumb drive stores 8 gigabytes of data. This is satisfactory for storing documents, email, pictures, and smaller files. Do not back up movies, large music libraries, or huge batches of photos. We will show you how to exclude those large file items when using Time Machine. If you and your parents wish to back up the entire hard drive of your laptop, the school can provide you with information on external hard drives that you can purchase on your own. 500 gigabyte external USB drives start at around $70. Step 1 in using the Lexar thumb drive with Time Machine is to format the drive to work with Time Machine. Time Machine requires that the format of your thumb drive be Mac OS X extended. The Lexar drive is currently formatted in MS-DOS when brand new. We will format the Lexar drive with your MacBook Pro using Disk Utility. If you have any documents prior to doing this format, make sure and copy them to your hard drive. Insert your Lexar thumb drive in the MacBook Pro's USB port on the side. You should see an icon on the desktop that says Lexar. If you have renamed the thumb drive, remember that name. Click on the magnifying glass in the upper right hand corner and type Disk Utility. Press Enter. Disk Utility has the ability to format any drive, so be careful. We will select the drive named Lexar on the left side of the Disk Utility window. Next, we will click on the Erase tab towards the top of the window. In the Format pull-down menu, we will select Mac OS X Extended Journaled Format. In the Name box, we will make sure that the drive name is Lexar. Click the button that says Erase. To make sure that you want to erase, again click Erase in the dialog box. A blue progress bar will appear as the Lexar thumb drive is erased. You have successfully formatted your thumb drive. Step 2 will show you how to configure Time Machine to back up your files to the Lexar thumb drive. Go to the menu bar at the top right hand corner of your MacBook Pro and select Open Time Machine Preferences. When the Time Machine Preferences window opens, select Options. Under Options, we have the choice to exclude items from our backup. At this point, we would like to exclude the Lexar thumb drive that we will be backing up to. Drag the Lexar thumb drive into the window. Next, click the Add button. If your time machine is now showing the Macintosh hard drive, you are set to go. At this point, we want to exclude the system files from our Macintosh 
as we do not wish to back those up. Time Machine will ask us if we would like to exclude the system folder only or exclude all system files. We wish to exclude all system files. Time Machine will now calculate the amount of space that these files take up so as not to back those up. At this point we would also like to exclude movies and music from our backup. Click the Add button, go to your User folder, and under your User folder, you will see Desktop, Documents, Downloads, and other folders. At this point, we would like to exclude Music and Movies. You can select each of these separately and exclude them, or select them both. Once you have selected the item you wish to exclude, click Exclude. At this point, Movies and Music do not contain any files, and that is why they are showing zero kilobytes. As you add files into those folders, they simply will not be backed up. At this point, this is what we would like to exclude from our backup, and so we will save these items. Next, we would like to select the disk where we will have our files backed up. Click on Select Disk. Choose the Lexar thumb drive and say Use Backup Disk. At this point, Time Machine has turned itself on and is ready to back up your files. Simply close this system preference and the backup will start happening immediately.